what is going on guys Josh Smith here and uh, today is a very very special day and I cannot wait to share it with you guys we are on our way to go pick up our special guest for the day it is 6 15 I already went out this morning and uh, got bait we are going to be fishing the intercoastal of West Central Florida so we're going to be fishing for trout, redfish, maybe snook, who knows. There's a lot of bait out there right now, so the game fish should be feeding pretty heavily. So we'll see how it goes, but it's going to be a good day, guys. Stay tuned. All right, folks, we have our special guest with us now, and she has finally agreed to be on camera. This is my lovely girlfriend, Kaylin Burris, and um, today today's going to be really special, guys, because October, while it is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, it is also Dysautonomia Awareness Month, and you guys might not have heard about that. Um, I know I hadn't before this cutie. It's, uh, the color is blue, so what we're going to be doing today is a blue lure challenge. We have live bait, but we also have blue lures in honor of Kalen. We will explain further once we get out on the water. And maybe if Kalen wants to, she can talk a little bit about dysautonomia. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, we will catch back up with you guys out on the water. Stay tuned. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Kalen Burris. <laughs> All right, folks, we're heading out to the first spot. It's going to be windy out there, so I'm going to apologize ahead of time for the wind noise. Um, it is a little chilly out here. Uh, we're going to head out to the first spot and look for some breeder reds, some big old girls. Um, and then after that, we're just going to bounce around on some flats. We got the live well loaded with greenies and pinfish, so that's what we're gonna be throwing today in addition to the blue lures, which we can now explain. So, what I wanted to do is a blue lure challenge. What that is going to consist of is we're gonna fish with live bait and blue lures. If you get a fish on live bait, it's gonna be one point. If you get a fish on a blue lure, it's going to be worth two points. So it's going to be me versus Kalen going head to head. And um, it's going to be fun, guys. So stay tuned. Oh, 
a jack. Got him. <laughs> oh yeah, folks. Woo! This might be a little bit bigger one. Oh my gosh. You hear that drag, Caitlin? Holy crap. I can't even turn him. Come on, baby. It can't be a dolphin. Because that thing would have spooled me. Dad gum it! Yeah. I really don't know what that could have been. It came up, blew up on it at the top of the surface. And then just towards the end of that fight it felt like it was just stuck to the ground. Should have pulled anchor. Went out there and got it. Dad gum it. Got him now. Yeah, okay. You got him? Oh yeah. Oh, oh put it back, put it back, put it back, put it back, hurry. He's like, wait, where's my fish? Okay, well, it's too late. He looks so dead. Oh yeah, I mean, look at him. Throw it back out there. Okay, I'm sorry, bad, okay? <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Can you stop yelling at me? There's a knot somewhere. Up at the top. Get the camera off me. I got the hook. There it is. Yeah. Now I think it's got it. <laughs> That's a nice one. Might be a Mac attack. There's a line above your head, by the way. Oh, that's a big one, Kay! Holy smokes, look at that! I think my wrists are broken. Kaylin, that's a big jack. Nice. Nice. Good job, Kay. Can I touch it? Yeah. Alright, so what's the score, Kay? Okay? Not for long. Ow! <laughs>
<laughs> Got him. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, we're getting bigger, folks. Oh my gosh. I'm putting the lead on quick. I believe that's eight to three now. In the past three casts. All right, folks, we fished that spot out. We weren't getting anything but trout, so we're gonna make a move. I think it's about 10 o'clock. Still got a lot of bait and some time, so we're gonna make a move, try to get on some redfish and snook. We will see how that goes. But as always, folks, stay tuned. go to live another day. <laughs> that one feels like it's got some shoulders on it. How many redfish have we caught? I mean, it's insane. What the heck is that? Oh my gosh, Kaylin, you have a loon. Oh no, you don't. Do you have a hook? Ooh, that's a grown one! Look at that one, folks. That is a grown one right there. Can we keep it? Wow. Look at that.
that folks. All right, folks, we're gonna end the day on that redfish. Amazing job. We're gonna end it on a tie, 10-10. Nice and fair, everybody's happy. And uh, we will catch up with you guys back at the ramp. What's going on, guys? Thanks for watching today, really appreciate it. A couple things I wanted to go over is just kind of a recap of the day um, and then talk about this one a little bit. Anyway, so bait, baits for today, we pretty much utilized live bait all day. Uh, greenbacks rigged up on a one op circle hook with 25 pound leader. That's what we caught all the jacks on, a lot of redfish and some of the trout as well. And one of the blue baits in honor of dysautonomia and Kalen today that really worked well was this blue mirrodine made by Mirror Lure. And I caught a lot of trout on this. They were loving this color. And honestly, it might be one of my favorite baits now. So thanks, really thanks for watching guys. Um, Thanks, Kalen, for fishing with me today. Mm -hmm. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. You're going to be seeing a lot more of her in my videos. And um, just wanted to uh, make you guys aware of dysautonomia um, because Kalen was diagnosed with it well, three years ago? Like three years ago. And it's rare, but it seems to be... Um, being diagnosed in mostly girls uh, fairly regularly now so it's definitely we're, we're definitely becoming more aware of it and um, just wanted to make you guys aware of it and also just um, appreciate Kaylin because October is the awareness month for dysautonomia so this is one of her shirts that was made for her and that's why we wanted to do the blue lure challenge today. Um, in honor of Kalen and also um, for awareness for dysautonomia. So thanks for watching guys, really appreciate it. I think the ending score was 10-10, so we tied. So I won. She won, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, really appreciate it guys. As always, subscribe and like this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs down and give me some good feedback if you didn't like it, what you didn't like, what you did like, whatever. And as always, folks, stay tuned.